causes frizz are gaps in the cuticle layer. The cuticle layer looks sort of like um, shingles on a roof. And when they have gaps in there from damage or just from the, the uh, cuticle being lifted, then moisture gets in there, causes that cuticle to swell even more, and that's what causes this frizzy look. Now, what you need to use is something to stuff those gaps. The best thing, or what I've found works the best, is anything with silicone in it. So you're looking for products that have dimethicone, cyclomethicone, silicone, anything with that C-O-N-E on the end. This particular product um, is mainly olive oil based, but it does have some silicones in it. Um, you want to emulsify it in your hands really well. A little bit goes a long way with these products. They can make the hair look greasy. Uh, then you do not want to uh, put it anywhere near your scalp. You always want to apply it from the ends up. And I recommend when you're defrizzing curly hair, um, or any hair actually, all hair experiences frizz, you want to make sure that you do it when it's dry because that's when you're going to notice it the most. That's when hair is frizzing, is mainly when it's dry. It won't look frizzy when it's wet. So you just apply the product, or if it's curly, you just scrunch the product through once it's styled. That silicone goes in, stuffs those gaps, and helps to tame down the frizz. And that's how to tame frizzy hair. Thank you.